All right, yo, let's get into it. Y'all know the uh, the versus battle happened last night. Um, we're gonna just talk about how the beat the other B two K members are mad at Omarion because I believe it's because Omarion didn't invite them to the show. So the B two K members, uh, Fizz, Rasby, and Bug post a clip from o the Temptations, a clip. You know how they kicked the dude out the group, the lead singer, or whatever, whoever he was. He was troubled. You had to kick him out the group, and it was over for him, right? So, they post that, and they at Omarion. Y'all can check that out. Y'all see it. It's, it's all over the Instagram, right? So, Omarion, <laughs> finally, two hours later, he posted, Peace, family. I had a photo shoot this morning for my, you know what? Skip that. I ain't even, that, that part is not important. This is what he said about the people, honey. I love all the jokes and opinions. Y'all are hilarious. I'm enjoying the creativity. If you are lucky enough to be in this business for 22 years, you understand that at some point you will experience malfunction. It comes with being an artist and making yourself vulnerable to the world. But to my three background dancers, yes, he said three, three, three background dancers. I'm not surprised because this is how y'all always been, even while in the group. Praying for my downfall. Well, keep praying because I'm overbooked and busy. Meanwhile, y'all really got to get a job other than hating on O. I heard UPS is hiring, baby. Listen. <laughs> Look, overall, he went that. <laughs> Listen, the battle, we know Omarion can't sing live. We know Ray J can't sing live. Jeremiah can't sing live. Tank is barely holding on. Sammy did straight. And Mario won. And he did damn good. Now, he, he give a shout out to Mario for winning. Now, I saw this and I was just like, okay, the guys are clearly mad. Fizz, Bug, and Rasby are mad because they did not get invited. Here's the thing, right? It would make sense for him to invite them because him as a solo artist, he don't have enough hits. And it would have helped out had he brought them. He would have still lost because he's the lead singer and we find out that he can't really sing. Which, in my opinion, I never thought he was a great singer anyway. But this proved that he's just a poor piss singer. But anyway, um... So the guys are upset that they did not get invited. Now, one would say, hmm, whose side are you on? Should he have invited them? Well, we know Raz B. No, not Raz B. Fizz was hunching his girl April. Remember that? His ex-baby mama, uh, his ex, which is his baby mama. He been hun hunching her. I don't think that's something you truly get over. Even though Fizz apologized last year and all that kumbaya stuff, that doesn't mean he's trying to make braid with y'all tail. And obviously, he's just not interested. And I think Omarion also wanted to show that he could win the versus uh, solo dolo, which he didn't. He got his behind wax because he can't sing. And his performance was piss poor. But anyway, uh, that's how the guys feel. And I'm just like, y'all, y'all got a member in a group that hunches X. And then you got one that's been touched by Chris Stokes, allegedly. And is he's just emotional and he spaz out at any moment. And J Bug is just J Bug there. He can't really sing either. Um, Rasby is I. He's not really a singer either. But yeah, they're basically three backup dancers. And then once in the blue moon, you got Fizz rapping. But anyway, y'all, tell me what you think about this. Should he had to say, let bygones be bygones and let them come over? And perform because he know they ain't really got money like that and maybe that would I, do you get paid for the verse i think you do get paid for the verses hmm well you know those guys want an opportunity to get any limelight and, it, and i get it wouldn't make sense because he started out with b2k and he got to thank his fame for that however some things did went on in the group and that group is so dysfunctional between alleged rumors uh, of touching and all that it's just a lot going on in that group, so and we we just seen some of it. Uh, we don't know all that's going on, so I can understand probably why he went solo dolo. Um, I'm not judging either way, but tell me what you guys think in the comment section. Whose side are you on? Are you on the three blind mice, the three stooges who got bare minimum talent? Are you on Omarion who got looks and can dance and can barely sing, but he's the star of the group? Whose side are you on? Should he have brought them, or should he have left them hoes alone? Y'all tell me what y'all think about it. Me. I, I can understand him not bringing them along, but I can also understand the guys want to tag along, but I can also understand that y'all got to understand, baby, that you've been hunching this gal, so he ain't trying to make no money with you. Bye.